Okay. You are here. South Side Gate, Drawbridge Way, Mid Row, Substation, and North End. Now, if I had to guess, I'd say that would be where I'm going to find Sokolov. And looking at the dividers here, this seems to be by far the biggest map section. That means that there are going to be at least two more loading screens before I get to Sokolov's place. But that's actually not so bad, considering it doesn't seem like any of the buildings or anything have their own loading screens in this area. I mean, Pratchett's home was pretty big. It was almost the same size as Dr. Galvani's place, and there was no loading screen there. What is this? These are big rats. Get out of here! Get out of here, you mutant little buggers! Ooh. Oh! Pratchett's jellied eels. What a coinkadinky! I just knocked the bugger out. So he made his money by jellying eels. That is interesting. Is that his only export? I'm assuming there's something else. Maybe he made the brined hagfish as well. Maybe some of the other fishy products of Dunwall are also from him. It just wouldn't surprise me. It wouldn't. Okay, have I looked everywhere? There doesn't actually seem to be anyone walking around here. Which is both good and bad. Bad for the city and the state that it's in, but good for me. Because I get to sneak around absolutely everywhere. And take my time inspecting absolutely everything. Now, I want to go up here, first and foremost. Jeez Louise. This is very complex. Hup! Haha! <laughs> wow, look at me. Such an acrobat. So nimble. I'm going to go across there first, just to have a look, make sure there's nothing up here that I missed. Were those the only two runes in this area? What is that? Hey, hey, hey! I haven't been in this place yet. Huh? Really? Where's the entrance? Have I? No. I don't remember seeing a skinny guy like that knocked out, so that's got to be somewhere around here. Yoo-hoo! Skinny guy! <laughs> Where's your home? How do I get in there? Oh, maybe there's an ent- Oh, here we go, here we go. Aha! Uh -huh. Or is this... Pratchett's place? No, this is not Pratchett's place. Man! These people were all a little bit crazy, this whole building. Blood from the eyes. The outsider walks among us. Send us food, not bullets. Oh, Shrone, this is a lady person. So Sokolov sees, sees the, the captain, captain of the helm Aww. and the tusked leviathan. I'll take a pear. What, what do you see in stars? Was that a rotten pear? And I just ate it. Man. I gotta think about these things before I do them. It would have been interesting if they had made a plague system in this game. I mean, I know it could have been a bit annoying, but... Sort of like Mass Effect has when you make Paragon and Renegade choices. And what happens is you either get some of the plague and it enhances specific powers. Maybe it makes you a like a more evil looking character, a nastier, gnarlier looking guy. Or you resist the plague and you stay the goody two-shoes Corvo. But I think it would be interesting if they gave us the choice of becoming slightly more evil, and then your powers become darker. So, if you take that evil or bad route, then you'd get more things like Devouring Swarm. And maybe Possession, and Bloodthirsty, and Shadow Kill, whatever. Stuff like that. That would be so interesting if they had done something like that. But, you know, we know that- Whoa, 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 whoa. We know they didn't. Okay, can I go down further? See if there's anything down here that I'm missing. No. Apparently not. It's good that I found the place though. Ooh, ooh, ooh. More dead people. Is that all they have around here? What's that? What's that? Someone's talking. Someone's talking. Oh, Okay, good. Who's talking? We can't lose any more men to the Ark pylon. Oh, they touch the charger before your ship when the duty officer brings it by, and the Ark pylon will fry you. Oh. Those things. Give me the willies, sir. You'll be thankful when Slackjaw's boys come down the street to slit your ricker. 
It'll be fun to watch them turn to ash. There was a time when we didn't need these things to keep a gang of kids down. I think since the plague kids. hit, none of them expects to live past 20. So why be scared of anything? That's true enough, actually. People will be much more aggressive hey, if they've there. got the plague. Show yourself. What? City Watch, wake up. We've got some low-life breaking curfew. Let's show who owns the bridge. Who is that? Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh! Jeez Louise, was that me? No, that thing just shot me by chance. Okay. It shot me by chance. It was actually meant to shoot... Well, obviously he's not here anymore. But one of these two gangsters down here. You know, they were standing here, talking. The one guy was over there, the other guy was chilling over here, trying to peek here. around the corner. Shame! Were they just turned to ash? Wow. That actually kind of sucks for them. Huh. So, there's a charger or something that you can touch, and then that thing won't shock you. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know at all. Card scoreboard. Game one, bit is five coins each. Jack, Quilty. Whoa, 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 whoa. Quilty is not very good at cards, is he? <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Perhaps. Oh, I see. Okay, there's a knife in his chest. I was gonna say, perhaps this guy was playing against his dead friend. Like, playing cards against a corpse. That's possible. That is highly possible, given... This whole area's current condition. Let's just call it condition. D don't. Okay, that thing is highly unsafe. I'm gonna have to find another way around. And soon. Goodness. Ooh, ooh, can I go straight up here? Wow. No. I think, judging from what's going on here, I can probably hop over there, and then either hop over there, or onto that little house over there, and just go straight across. But, it does seem like there's a way around the bottom as well. Huh. It's over here. Huh. Well, well, well. I do think I'll have a look up here, won't I? Yes, yes, I will. No, what? There's nothing. Okay, fine. Let's get out of here. All the way down. Onto the dumpster, I guess. That's fine. Shame, so those two guys that were gonna break their friend out so that he could show them or tell them where the pearls were, are dead. They were sizzled to smithereens. I guess it happens. I mean, they were just saying that the life expectancy is kind of low, and that proves it. That proves it once more. So somewhere in this map, or in one of the four maps in this mission, I'm gonna be finding some guy locked up. I should look out for that. Ooh, what is this? I do need me some of that. Slack George shipment note. Here's the elixir you need to sell on Caldwin's bridge this week. When you've moved everything, bring the money back to the distillery. I'll give you your cut and next week's shipment. If you're too dumb and you get caught, throw the elixir in the river so they can't give it to Sokolov. I don't want him figuring out what we're doing. Then throw yourself into the river too. <laughs> oh, Slack George. He doesn't, like, mince his words. You know, he just... Tells it like it is, says it straight. It kind of reminds me of someone I saw recently that was incredibly unnerving. Bane, from the Batman movie. Kind of reminds me of him, but they're not nearly the same. Bane was terrified. Just tells his lackey to kill himself, and he does it. That's disgusting. There's nothing really going on down here. Am I even supposed to be here? Bam! <laughs> Bam. Okay. Well, I guess this could potentially be a way around, but I also want to explore up there. There could be interesting goodies. Although, uh, there are no runes or bone charms, so maybe it's not even worth it. Hmm. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I might use one of my rewire tools on there because I've got so many of them, I keep picking them up or finding them, and I don't have space. So... Perhaps it's a good idea to just use it. Because why not? I see no reason not to. Shh, shh. What am I hearing? 
You can bash it. Oh, can I use the rewire tool here? No, no, no. Rewire. <laughs> oh, no, 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 unrewire. 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 Did I just rewire it to kill the gods? That's not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted. Okay, where'd that god go? I need to save these gods now. I can't believe I'm saying that, but I need to do it. Or did it just kill it? No, I think it dealt with the gods. Okay, I definitely... Shh, 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 shh. Wait, there's someone. There's someone around here. I definitely wasn't supposed to do it that way. Oh my goodness. How many of them just got killed? There must have been at least three gods in this area. There's one over there. I don't see a single one left here. Oh no. I hope that doesn't affect my chaos rating. Not that it should. Okay, I haven't really killed anyone up until this point. So, a couple of deaths here wouldn't be such a big deal. But still, now I know. I guess now I know not to do that again. Okay. Is there really nothing here to pick up? That is so boring. Ooh, 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 ooh. I am definitely going to take the high road. This is going to be entertaining. Can I climb? Please tell me I can climb up here. Wow. Look, look, look. Hop, 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 hop. I can do this. Hold on. Wait. Perhaps not from right here. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Hold on. Someone over there. Are there any other gods? I don't see any other gods. I think I'm going to deal with him. There we go. Done and done. Definitely not rewiring that one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, there's someone up here. Can I go across? Can I, can I make this? No, no. Oh. But if I jump, I can. What? What the heck? I don't want to go too close to that pylon because it's probably going to kill me. So... Ooh, no, 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 no. I wonder if I'll make it if I jump. It's probably worth a try. Huh. I'm assuming that that pylon will kill me in one shot. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to be close. This is going to be so close. <laughs> I did it. I did it. No, no, no. That was so sneaky. Oh, he's right up here. I've got him. He is done for. Open. Up we go. Uh, I don't even need to strangle this guy. I'll just shoot him with the sleeping dart. There's no reason to save the darts because I've got so many. And I would just go ahead and assume that I'm close to the end of the mission. Oh, wait. I'm... No! No! <sighs> this is just not going very well. Not at all. Now, oh, where did he go? Dude, show yourself. <coughs> okay, I must not cut the corners. I learned my lesson the hard way. I might be able to strangle him if I can just make it up there quick enough. Oh, no, he's moving again. That's it. I'm gonna have to shoot him. Shh, shh, shh. I can't see if he's actually there. Good shot. Wow, that was amazing. Perfect. Done and no, 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 no! Did I just waste a dot there? Oh man! They found me! Oh, down there, they found their friend unconscious. I know you're somewhere around here. Listen, I know you're somewhere around here too. So don't even worry about it. Don't sweat it. I'm coming for you. You won't have to look very hard. <laughs> How will I get down there quickly now? Oh, can I go over there? Don't fall through. Don't fall through. Good. I've got him. I've got him. I'm having so much fun with these dots. They are amazing. I mean, I realize I may be wasting them a little bit, but what the heck? Shh, shh, shh. Did someone just call me a hagfish? That is a very interesting insult. It really is. Again. He just said it again. Now I'm going to wait till he walks by here. I'm going to blink in behind him and strangle him. No, dude. You're not going to be flushing anything out. <laughs> wow! This is so much fun. I can't get enough of it. You know, this just makes me so 
so keen for the Dunwall City Trials. I will rock that stuff. Well, not really, but I will try. I will most definitely try get my name on the leaderboards. So everyone can see. The name of Lumen. It's gonna be so much fun. Can't wait. This place is rather complex looking. Huh. Okay. So, we gotta just keep going. And I wanna make sure I get everything there is here. Hopefully I'll find some more sleep dots soon because I didn't realize I was actually running kind of low. I've only got two left. But that should be enough. I only need one. The one I need will be for Sokolov, and that's that. I would prefer to get up close and personal with Sokolov instead of shooting him with a sleeping dot because I would want to hot that guy. That would be the one person in the entire game. Him and Piero, they are such iconic characters that you'd have to use the heart on them. What is this going to do? Maybe that'll turn the spotlights off. No, that's going to sound the alarm. Oh, wait, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck is this? Did I just create myself a bridge? Wow. That's amazing. That is perfect. But there are a whole bunch of guards over there. And there's another arc pylon. I hope these aren't a thing going forward. Because they are quite annoying. I must say, I don't enjoy my time with them. Not at all. Oh, what is that down there? Huh. I actually want to go and look. So, I'm hoping I don't die or something if I blink down here now. No, no, I didn't. What is this? Another arc pylon. Isn't this a waste of the whale oil? Considering they were like one, two, three, four. There must be five or six of them on this bridge alone. Can I not go down there? Can I? Hmm. Simple as that. I want to see what's in here. Oh, that's an alarm. Okay. What, what, can I go in there? Please tell me I can go in. No. What? Oh, I can go over there. No. I'm going up again. Then I'm going to go around. I'm so confused right now. Get up. Get up. Get up. Perfect. Perfect. Now I'm going to go over here. And in. No. 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 And in here. Wow. There's like a whole bunker under this bridge. This is amazing. Goodness. Again, I, I'll give it to these level designers. They know what they're doing and they know how to make an interesting level. Because I would say that 80% of gamers miss at least 70% of all this content. Shame on them. Shame on them. Come on, the guys at Arcane Studios put so much effort and definitely time into this. That's well worth seeing. It really is. I could not have imagined my playthrough being like a quick chaotic one. Just running through and killing everything and not even caring about exploring anywhere. Because I would imagine you could probably clear this entire mission in like 10 minutes? Maybe? And here I am probably an hour and a half in already and I'm only halfway. That's how you're supposed to play these games. I tell you now. That's the way you do it. Now, how do I get back to where I was? Can I go up here again? Oh, no. This is so not going to happen. Hop. <laughs> Hop. Is it depowered? Did I? Did I depower it? I don't even care. You know what? I don't even care. Go. Okay, I made it. That was probably pretty close, but what the heck ever. I like to live on the edge. Now, on to the next little part of the bridge. How many guards are there? There's at least one or two down there, and there's one up there. And was there one halfway up? Oh, and there's one over there. Okay. I would say four in total. And well, that shouldn't be a problem. I can't use any more sleeping dots on them, sadly, but that just makes it all the more intense. No way. Am I really doing this? Look at all these chains hanging up here. <gasps> That's how I get up here. I was about to say, am I going to get all Mowgli 
up in this business. Yeah, I can't wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Time to do some swinging from chains. From chains to chains. No, no, let me in. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Let's disable this. I don't see any items, so I can disable it. Now, this is where the fun starts. On the chain. What is the point of going all this way up? Can I jump? Hop! Ooh. That's so good! Hop! There we go. And hop! Ah! Wow! Glorious victory! Oh! What is this? Dude, how did you get all the way up here? A rewire tool. Perfect. It must be one of Slack Jaws guys, and they were planning like a hostile takeover or something, and he was the, the poor guy who drew the short straw, and he had to climb all the way up the bridge to rewire the arc pylons. Man, gotta suck to be him. Look at those shadows. That is magnificent. Now, I wonder if you can, from here, see the Hound Pit's pub, or what is that? That's gotta be an important landmark. That big tower over there. My goodness. It's beautiful. It is jaw-droppingly beautiful. And I feel I may be missing out by not going on that bridge, but I can go down here and then back across the bridge to see if I missed anything. There's that. It shouldn't be a problem. There, 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 there. There's some ugly texture work. Wow. Okay, I suppose I'm not supposed to be zooming in on that, so it's fine. But I'm also going to guess that's on the next map. Still, that looks like the kind of place where Sokolov would be performing his little experiments and stuff. Yes. But then, how big could this middle map possibly be? Look at that little area over there. That is literally one little corner in the street. Then you at the next map. Because that's definitely part of the last map. That big building over there. Huh. I'm intrigued. Is there anything here? I can't believe I have to rely so much on dark vision to see items, but they hide them so. They really do. I don't want to be spending all my time looking for items. No. No, I want to know where they are so I can just pick them up immediately. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Authorized personnel only. Well, I just authorized myself by opening that gate. I'm taking these out here. <laughs> Done. Shoot through the heart with a loaded pistol Shoot 